guys. Um, I'm trying to do this quick, but yet I feel like I have a lot to say, so that'll be hard. Um, I did not vlog yesterday because I did not um, schedule my time very well, and I thought, well, if I don't get in the morning, that'll be fine. I can do it at lunch, and then Travis called me, and we ended up making a plan to um, run into Omaha and run some errands, and then we took supper out to my parents. So because we did that, I skipped my lunch and worked through it so that I could leave early so that we could get our stuff done, and then by the time we got home, it was 10 o'clock. Um, and so I just did not, I did not vlog. Um, Today, I did, um, and yesterday I had the PB&J pancakes for breakfast, and um, I got a new jelly. It's Welch's brand, I think. Um, the next time I use it, I will pull it out and look at it and show you. But it's really similar um, to my other, like the Polander stuff. It's just a little bit cheaper for what you get, and um, I just like it better. It's a better spread um, for my pancakes and stuff. It's almost, it just works better. Um, for the consistency and just one second I'm going to see if diesel's ready to come in. No, he wasn't at the door yet. Um, so today I'm having eggs and I got um, this weekend some light English muffins so I'm having one of those with my eggs um, and I just put two slices of Canadian bacon in it, no spinach and a little bit of cheese. So I have not calculated it up yet. But my guess is it's going to be around 300 calories. Um, and for my snack, I only have an apple. Yesterday I had my Greek yogurt. And yesterday I didn't eat breakfast until I got to work. So then the yogurt ended up working and then skipping lunch. I had nothing to eat there. And I was going to go down to the vending machine and get a sandwich. Um, which would have been really high in sodium. But not really bad otherwise. But the vending machine was broke. And by that point I was starving. And I did not know what else to do. So I got a bag of... Sun chips, um, which I mean, isn't healthy, obviously. I mean, it's not great, but it worked. It tied me over. Um, just watching Diesel outside, make sure he's behaving. Um, but I did notice because all I have for a snack today is an apple, but I will eat my breakfast at work, so that'll work because it'll be later. I know this morning I'm like everywhere because I'm trying really hard to be on time um, to make up for some of the time when I left early yesterday. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, but the reason I only have an apple, um, because I was going to do hard-boiled eggs, but I did not get those started in time because I was doing laundry this morning, and, um, then I thought, well, I could peel a carrot because I haven't done that, and I did not get that done either, but luckily I have an apple. So, the moral of the story is food prepping is so important, even if it's something as small as snacks. I mean, I'm not to the point yet where I can meal prep an entire week's worth of meals. I'm just not that organized. I'm not that, I don't like to plan ahead that far. I like to have ideas in my head, but I don't like to, um, I guess, what's it called? Be tied down to that exact thing. Um, and like with my breakfast, I don't want to plan, I don't want to make a bunch of pancakes ahead of time because they're not very good, you know, reheated. Um, and eggs, I'm not, I don't really want to do those ahead of time either, but they're also fast and easy. But what I'm saying is, I, oh God, how does the saying go? Where you fail to plan, plan to fail. Um, and so today my snack will be okay because of time, but it's just really important to make time. And that's, I'm trying to be really careful not to say I didn't have time because I just did not make the time. I didn't budget my time well enough to do that. Um, and yeah, I have a lot of things to do. I just need to learn to schedule my time better. Um, so yeah, we're having some friends over tonight for supper, and at lunch I will get into that, because you guys will not be impressed. Um, but I'm going to leave it at that for now, and I'm going to go to work, and I will probably see you guys at lunch. So, have a good morning, and I'll see you later. Guys, um, just really quick at lunch, because I am running around like a crazy person trying to get laundry and dishes and stuff picked up because we're having friends over. I have to work, and I have to run to the store and get the stuff that we're eating. I just don't know what happens to the time and I'm kind of like tired of saying that and thinking that but I don't understand like because I'm constantly da -da 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 going is how I feel and it's just I feel like I'm spinning in circles um, I'm just having my shake for lunch I don't know why I said that weird um, and I'm kind of trying to keep my calories low today I have not 
calculated them up, haven't added them up because I can't really do that at work and I just haven't had time to do it. Um, but tonight we are having a cheesy fry night and we're having that because um, Tuesday nights used to be, we used to go to the bowling alley in town. Um, and it had started before I came along. That's actually where I met Travis. Um, his aunt, I worked with his aunt and she wanted us to meet and I put it off for so long and she was on bowling league and she said, just come, you know, they always come hang out and just, you know, whatever. And so I was like, well, I'll just go just to, um, meet him and just have it be over. Like, I don't even, you know, nothing's gonna happen. I don't even care. Here we are three years later. Um, well, I ended up being a sub on her team because after I met Travis, the rest is pretty much history. We pretty much spend every day together. Um, since then, <laughs> it's not even an exaggeration. Um, and so I became a sub on the team and would bowl on Tuesday nights. And their biggest um, thing on the menu was their awesome cheesy fries. And it's just fries with loaded with cheese and um, bacon bits, which I'm not a huge fan of, and ranch. And I'm trying to play with the dog at the same time because he's feeling neglected as well. Um, yeah, but anyways, the bowling alley closed about, gosh, a year and a half ago. I mean, it's been a while. And so every once in a while, I and mean, we've probably done a couple times on a Tuesday night randomly, we'll say, let's make cheesy fries. Um, just because that's something that we did. And yeah, that was something I did when I was getting back to my unhealthy ways. Um, but I purposely keep my calories low so that it's not too crazy. I'm planning on baking ours because... Um, Tina, who's coming over, is also on a weight loss journey, and if you're watching Tina, hi. Um, and so I know she's kind of worried because she just kind of started over about eating them, um, I, and I don't blame her. I should not be eating them either, because um, she had said, you know, what are we going to have, sweet potato fries? And I said, well, we could do that, or you just have a cheat meal, not a cheat day, a cheat meal. Um, I said, or we do what we do when I make meat nachos, you know, I make him his and I portion mine out and so I know exactly what mine are. Um, we can do that with the fries. My plan is to bake the fries, at least ours. Um, we'll probably have to fry the guys' I don't know. Um, and I have reduced fat cheese. I won't put bacon. I have fat-free ranch. It's not a healthy meal by any means. It's not balanced. Um, but it won't be the end of the world with my calories. Even though I don't know what they are, I know how to estimate them. So, all in all, it won't be too crazy as long as I don't get out of control with eating them. But that's the story behind that. And so, like I said, not a lot of you are going to be impressed because here I am complaining that I can't lose weight, that I'm stuck on a plateau, and I'm going to eat cheesy fries. I know. But after that, it's back on normal. I'm sticking with it. I got chicken in the fridge thawed. Um, so yeah, I'm still working. I'm not, I have two weeks left on Chilean Extreme and I'm not too terribly, I don't know what the dog's doing, worried about my weight. Um, I am and I'm not. I'm going to weigh myself, but I'm not going to freak out about it. I'm not going to stress about it. Um, I'm just going to work on lifting the weights and doing my measurements when I'm done and see what my progress is there. So, as long as I'm losing inches, even if I'm not losing pounds as fast, I'm still doing what I'm setting out to do, which is be smaller. So, that's my goal there. Um, and yeah, I have an idea what I'm going to do next, but I'm not... I'm pretty sure I'm going to do it, but I don't know for sure, for sure. Um, but I'll tell you guys about that probably tomorrow, um, and to see if you guys want to be a part of it. I'm, I'm pretty excited. I think it'll be fun. Um, so we'll see. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow though because I gotta head back into work um, so that I can get the rest of the day going. So I am probably gonna maybe try and upload this actually today because with them coming over and whenever they leave, um, 
I'll probably try to get some work done because I have not been very good at doing that this week. Uh, I know it's only Tuesday, but I just haven't. So I probably for sure will not vlog anymore. So I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow. Have a good day. Good night. Make healthy choices. Make healthy choices that I'm making. Um, but, you know, at the same time, I just, you know, I say it all the time. I'm doing this to be real, to be a life. Um, it's it's for life. And if I don't allow myself a few cheats, a few bad things for you, I won't succeed because I'll fall back into that because I'll want to eat them and then I'll just start eating them all the time. Whereas if I know that it's a special treat every once in a while, it's not so bad. Um, and today was two cardios. Tomorrow will be late weightlifting. Um, which I like to do a cardio after my cheat day, but that'll be okay. Hey, maybe it'll switch up. Maybe it'll benefit me. So I don't know, but I'm going to stop talking because I literally just keep going. Um, see how I get distracted. So I'll talk to you guys later and, um, like I said before, have a good day.